Right, so the warm weather, we all like it, but this is also the time of year where you typically see some more animals outside too. Right, and baby animals. So this time of year, you start to see them in the wildlife, but unfortunately, a lot of people are picking them up or bringing them inside. Sure. Wildlife experts saying that's not what you should do. From fawns to ducklings, hundreds of you will find baby animals over the next few months. So when a mother is nowhere in sight, our first reaction is to save the animal, but actually, it's the last thing you should do. I think there's this mis misconception that if you find a, a baby, a, a young animal, and it's by itself, that it's uh, abandoned or, if it's, or that it's orphaned. Wildlife officers say the best thing to do is to step back and call. Contacting a, a licensed wildlife rehabilitator uh, if you come across one of those, those injured animals is uh, um, the best route to take. And most people do. Birds of Flight Sanctuary in Warren will receive over 5,000 calls in the next three months. Most of the time, callers will be told not to do anything at all. And a lot of times we tell people to leave them alone and put them back. Rabbits especially, you know, if you know where the nest is, put them back. Some situations are obvious not to interfere, but Heather says people still try to be a hero. And they always tell us birds are attacking us. I'm like, yeah, that's because it's their parents. They want their baby back, so give them their baby back. It's not that we don't care, but this is what wildlife is. It's wild. And with birds, they grow fast. A bluebird is full grown in just 17 days. We have a lot of fledgling birds right now. And what happens is mom will take them out of the nest about a week before they can fly. That's when she teaches them how to forage for food and to do everything that they need to do to survive on their own. It's a critical time that they stay with their mother. Now also the common sense. We've heard the myth before right. that, hey, if you see a baby bird, it fell out of the nest. Don't touch it. You know, sure. that scent could be put on, your scent could be put on right. the baby bird and the mother wouldn't touch it. Well, that's actually not true. So if you see a bird, just pick it up, put it back in the nest, and then leave it be. Wildlife experts get too many calls, and they're just telling people, hey, don't do anything at all. All right, sounds like good information. More 27 First News at 11 coming up after the break.